We are going to take a moment to look at the voicings that we're going to use for progression six, which is Miles Davis's uh, Solar. And there is a description of it on the blackboard, but I thought it'd be nice to have a video so you could really see what the hands are doing. So let's take a look. The first chord um, is C minor major. And this is, we did talk about this a while ago, but we didn't really hit it too uh, broadly. So a C minor major, this is C major seven. When you have C minor major, you have to make the third minor, but the seven stays major. So from the bottom up, it's, you know, C, B, E flat, G. It is a funny sounding chord. It's very jazzy sounding. It's definitely used more in the jazz realm. Um, but, but that's what it is. That's the first chord of the song. Then to get to the next one, you're just going to have to pick up your hand and move it to G minor 7. There's no, you know, quick way we're going to do that because what we want to do at this point is do the coker voicings for the two five ones. So hopefully you have all those two five ones bracketed. So you're looking at G minor, C, F major. Then you turn that into a minor, flat your middle notes. This is just like the exercise that you guys have already done. Now I'm on the last line, E flat minor seven. Don't forget it's all black. You're pinching, resolving to D flat major. Now at this point, when you're playing D flat major seven, to get to D minor seven with a flat five, all you have to do is take your pinky and raise it up to the D, and look, now you've got a D minor seven with a flat five. Because this would be regular D minor, so you want to flat that five, so there it is. So do that one more time, so D flat major seven, raise your pinky, and hopefully you have remembered to also put the last two chords in brackets because that is a minor 2-5. So D flat minor 7 flat 5 to G7 flat 9. All you got to do is pinch on the left hand. Don't change your right hand at all. And you've got G. Look, here's the 7, here's the flat 9. And then at that point, it goes back to the beginning. And I would like you to do this progression two times with the metronome or the play along, whatever works for you.